Doctors are reminding everybody to get their annual flu shot this year. Jose Alonso spoke to East Texans and a couple of specialists about what this year's flu season could look like. Everybody's throat is already getting scratchy. Tyler resident Keandra Williams fears this year's flu season could be rough. I tend to catch the flu really easily, so I get cautious. Williams says she got the flu vaccine last Friday, and she's nervous about the next few months. Meanwhile, other community members are opting out of the shot. I like to let their immune systems fight off sickness like that, builds it stronger. Melissa Buns had a bad experience getting the flu shot for herself and doesn't want her kids to go through the same thing. I got so sick I was almost put in the hospital and because it was the year that they started introducing the live viruses more rapidly and I just opt out now. Are you scared of the flu? Yeah. Carolina Herrera says she doesn't want to get sick and her dad Pedro says his family hasn't gotten the vaccine but they're not against it. It's good. The thing is, we haven't gotten it yet because we haven't needed it. They're predicting a rough ride with, with flu this year. Registered nurse Patricia Crowder works with assisted living communities, a community where doctors are suggesting this year get a stronger dose of the flu vaccine. Are they giving that stronger dose or what? what is the action being taken at these places? Yes, we're following, of course, you know, CDC guidelines as far as, you know, for the high dose for our residents who are over 65. And like I said, this year we are seeing better participation than we saw last year. Just like Keandra's family, she made sure her grandmother received a vaccination. She's at home and the grandkids come around and all of them go to school now. So I don't want her to be put in a situation where she can get infected and then she needs the best that she can get for her body. In Tyler, Jose Alonso, CBS 19. Oren Crowder also mentioned that it's important to care for yourself if you catch the flu. She says the easiest way to do that is staying home and washing your hands frequently.